This is Brandon Wolf speaking, the USWO Television and UCW Southern States Champion, letting you know that you're watching Realistic Fishing. And just like Alex, keep it realistic. Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. To get this evening started, we're going to fish with this. The Realistic Fishing No Claw Craw. I think this is my last power bait chigger craw. So I have a few other things to try and I'll rip the claws off of them as well. But this one has been magic. This particular shape with the little antenna hanging off the end has done very well. I'm fishing it on a Texas rig, a 1 8 ounce weight, and a 3 aught EWG. Oh, I had a little bite there. My line twitched. Could have been something small. Anyway, let's keep trying. I'm glad it's getting bites. I don't know why it gets so much attention, but it gets attention from small fish, big fish, bluegill, bass. Hey, see that wake? There are fish around here. Well, I haven't really gotten any bites since I decided to go left. I think we're going to turn around and head the other way. Is that a fish? This is John from Knoxville, Tennessee. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. I got a fish and a snag. We're gonna head over here, up on top of the dock to see if I can figure out how I have a fish and a snag. The fish has since come off. That is so crazy. Dang it. I'm about to lose my rig and I don't know why. That was crazy. So I had a fish there. I don't know if you saw it. Um, it jumped out of the water when I was getting up on the dock. I need a new rig and that means a new craw. We're gonna try something else. As I tie the rig, I'm going to make my way down this way. I think by going out on the dock, I may have scared any other fish away. So we'll have to come back to this spot later. Now I have to decide what other lure I'm going to use. I got some Excite Craws here. I also have some Cook 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 Carls. The Excites are a little bit larger. Yeah, let's go with one of these Excite High Floater Craws. Oh, no, 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 don't do it. Ah, ah, no, 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 don't do it. Ah, ah. Okay, this is what we're going to fish with. 
and it's a little bit thick right here. I'm gonna bite. I'm gonna bite a chunk of this out so that my hook is actually sitting in a little gap here. Yeah, that looks better. I don't like how thick it is at the head right there. Let's get it rigged up. Clawless Craw number two here. This is the Excite version. The other one was a Powerbait Chigger Craw version, and I liked that one a lot. Let's beat it up a little bit. Stretch, stretch, stretch. That's a decent amount of hook gap, I guess. Let's see if we can get a bite on this Excite version of the Clawless Craw. This is Mark Pickett from The Fishing Magician. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Oh, that was a good one. fish. Got him. That's a pretty good one. Let's see if I can keep him on the line. It's got me wrapped up in that little piece of brush right there, but I got him out. Nice. There we go. I got one on the Excite. Check it out. That is not a bad fish. Yeah, we got a nice largemouth bass here. Maybe about a pound. The sun is starting to go down. It's getting a little bit dark, but I'm happy to get one on the clawless craw. Let's get a quick picture with this fish. Yeah, there we go. Just to get a good look at it from a different angle. We got about a one pound bass here. Again, the clawless craw, I'm telling you. Let's let him go. Still got my lure. Let's get it straightened up. Yeah, still looks good. We're gonna keep fishing it. So, even though it's not a power bait, fish. I was just saying, even though it's not power bait, I'm still getting bites. And I'm still catching fish. Here we go. Fish number two. That's back to back casts. Hooked in that side plate, he wasn't coming off. I'm Slim from Wisconsin, Milwaukee. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Got to give it a quick pop sometimes. There we go, got it. Here we are, bass number two. Maybe three quarters of a pound. Let's get some light on him. Not quite as big as that last one, but still a good fish. Clawless Craw strikes again. Still got my lure. It walked its way up the line in true Texas rig fashion. What can I say? They love the clawless craw. It's kind of hard to say it. Clawless craw. 
I had success on that first version, which was the original version, which is the power bait chigger craw. But this excite craw is also catching fish. This video is another good example of how the clawless craw can catch bass. I had some bites on the power bait version, but I lost it to a snag. So I went with an excite and I caught a couple more bass. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.